Uh, Riz Harris in and bowls. And that one is turned into the leg side by Lloyd. And he's going to get a run here now. Then he might have to hurry. If that hits, he's in trouble. He's in trouble and he's gone. A direct hit from Mason Crane at mid wicket. One stump to aim at. Lloyd has gone. As uh, Hamza is in to bowl, that's on leg stump, and uh, that is something of a freebie for Wayne Madsen to get off the mark. Flicked off his legs down towards backward square. Dismissing their former captain early. That's clipped into the leg slide, slightly uppishly, but it'll run away for four runs past uh, Douthwaite at square leg. Here comes Crane to Reese, who's on the back foot, and... Hitting it through the covers, and that will be a boundary for Lewis Rees, taking his score on to 22, Derbyshire 61. As Crane comes in again to Madsen, who tries to sweep, and he manages to connect firmly with this one, and that will reach the boundary at the rate of knots. Wayne Madsen moves on to 16. As, uh, James Harris bowls, and he was almost a goner there, Wayne Madsen. He's got a, a little faint inside edge, and then it went... Harris bowls, bowled him, full legs delivery, ball nestles between the off stump and the leg stump, and Wayne Madsen has gone, he was playing quite an expansive drive at that one, it was full of length. Here's Crane to Guest, who drives off the back foot, nicely, Kieran Carlson has a chase on, at long off here, bizarre mode of dismissal as he rocks back onto the back foot and pulls that through the mid-wicket region for another boundary. Very firmly hit by Brooke Guest. Crane is in and Guest rocks back again onto the back foot and pulls this one backward of square for four runs. In comes in to Guest who drives off the back foot onto the offside very nicely through the covers for another boundary. Very stylish shot from Brooke Guest who moves on to 18. Harris bowls, and uh, that is again outside off stump, and Guest tucks into it and smacks it away to the Douthwaite to Guest. Again, short, caned away as uh, Guest in to bowl to Guest outside off stump, driven through the covers for four runs by the Derbyshire wicketkeeper. Ingram is in again. Bowls to Reese, who uh, sweeps nicely backward of square, a long way backward of square. And once it got past Dan Dowsweight, it just raced away to the boundary. As Crane bowls, a full toss that is hit back over long on and just about crosses the ropes by Brooke Guest. The score as Hamza is in and bowls. Jim always edged that in between uh, the <sighs> wicketkeeper and the slip. It might have hit the floor as. It was uh, right alongside Colin Ingram. Derbyshire look comfortable here as Hamza's in and Guest drives nicely through the offside and he'll get four runs for that shot. Guest approaching his half century now. He moves on to 47 wickets from one of them now as he's in to Guest who drives well through the covers and he'll get four runs for those and a fine way for Brooke Guest to bring up his half century. It's crying. Bowls that is driven straight back down the ground for four runs by Lewis Reese. Nice shot. Hits the boundary rope now. Crane is in. Balls to the left handed Reese who flicks it into the leg side out towards the straightish mid wicket boundary for four. I think you could count uh, chances or false shots as this next one is swept by Lewis Reese for four runs to backward square leg. Really nice shot from Reese. Count the false shots on the of David Lloyd as that is floated up by Carlson and hammered by Guest out towards the cover boundary and it just about makes it over the ropes on one of the longest parts of the ground towards the draw, isn't it? As Carlson is in again and Reese moves back onto the back foot and plays it nicely through mid wicket for four as Carlson bowls. And that's driven into the offside by Brooke Guest. It is five o'clock. There are only 15 overs remaining of the game and hands are being shaken. It is a draw, ladies and gentlemen.